Hello everyone and welcome back to Skyrim! Ah, I missed you guys so much! Ah. You have no idea. I've just wanted to play this damn game. I did play some with my cousin. Uh, we restarted and we made a lizard man named Gorgo. His name was Gorgo the Lizard. It was freaking fantastic as hell. He immediately rolled into Riverwood and started killing people. He shot Sven ver first, which was good. And then he killed Feindall, so he took rid of, he, he took rid of, he got rid of all the annoying ones. What are you doing, Feralda? Get, get, get going. Do your little, <sighs> shiny. She likes the shiny. And then uh, after Gorgo ravaged the town of Riverwood, we headed over to Morthal and did a, a pretty cool quest line there. In fact, once I get done with these first ones here, I think I might head down there. I know I'm not really uh, sticking to one quest line, and that's because, A, I am seriously ADD with this game. Okay, throw the other thingy and let's get moving. Come on. Don't have all day. Or do I? Do I have all day? Where's my quest thing even pointing me? Oh. The wrong way. Sorry, Winterhold. I'm busy doing other things. I want to know what this black star thing's all about. Oh my god. I just realized how long I can sprint after playing a new character. My god, I have so much stamina. I can run for days. Playing as Gorgo, the... What the hell? Oh, right. I still have to look. Um, I'm going to assume it's at the inn. This is the inn, right? The Frozen Hearth. That sounds like an inn. Anyway. What was I saying? Oh, it, it made me realize that I kind of like two-handed weapons. The smell. Like some horrible monster was turned inside out and then exploded. Oh. What did you do? It was a minor miscalculation. I've already corrected it for future experiments. This. This is why people have a problem with your college, Nelikar. Quit blowing stuff Dagor up, dude. and I have an understanding. He gives me privacy, and I make sure my experiments don't blow up his inn. Is one of his eyes messed up, or...? Well, I'm looking for an Elven Mage who studies stars, Who so. sent you? Was it the college? The Jarl? We agreed there would be no more questions. Who is neither? Hmm. You're working with the Daedra? Right. Now tell me the one about the Argonian maid and the lusty baron. Ha ha ha. I'll pay. I'll pay, I guess. <laughs> I don't know really know. My soul. If only you understood the irony. What do you know about soul gems? Um, they're for enchanting. That's pretty much all I know. They are. Except the gem is always consumed. They're frail. Except for one. Azura's star. A Daedric artifact that allows any number of souls to pass through it. Some of us wanted to find out how. I was working under Malin Varan then. If only we knew what he was really planning. Huh. That's actually, this is kind of cool. Malin wanted to alter the star. He was dying. Disease. He thought he could store his own soul inside. Become immortal. It drove him mad. Students started dying. Eventually, the college exiled him. He took a few loyal disciples to Illinolta's deep and vanished. Look, I don't care who asked you to find the star, but don't take it back to Azura. The Daedra are evil. They're the reason Malin went insane. I had no idea I was working for the Daedra. I don't, uh, I don't know what's going down all right. at all. But, um, I just realized something. And I realized it this time. Yeah, I'm smart. I am smart. Usually I forget when I play with other people. Because they don't want to just die a million times. Because it's unpleasant. It's unpleasant to get brutally murdered. So, how was your Christmas, guys? Huh? How was it? Tell me. Mine was pretty awesome. Not gonna lie. I got a solid state hard drive. I'm gonna install it soon with a friend. Actually, I'm gonna install it soon with Brandon from the, uh... The trying to play through Canervis or Canervis or Canervisis or that guy. 
He's smart. He put all of our computers together. Me, Pigeon, his own, and then uh, Kyle, or Keel. Put all of them together, because he's a genius, and we all just kind of... I was the last one to make it, because I'm poor, and I work at Subway, and woe is me. Blah, blah, blah. I can't wait to leave that job. Ah. Actually, uh, left a note for my boss yesterday because we, I think it was like one of the busiest days the source ever had yesterday because it was just hell. We were there for like an extra hour cleaning up when usually we're gone by the time, like five minutes after we close, we're gone. This time it was 55. So I was kind of annoyed. Um, I had a headache the whole time, otherwise it wouldn't have been too big of a deal. Anyway, I left a note for my boss saying either I need more hours or I can't continue to work there. Because A, my bosses are total D-bags, and I don't care if they, if they happen to be fans of the series, then unsubscribe and get out of here, you D-bags. You guys are rude. And uh, I left a note, because they've been giving me one shift a week for like three weeks, and I think it's because I was sick once. Well, I mean, I, I've taken a, a day off every once in a while, but I always get someone to cover for me. It's never an issue. I never, like, ditch work. I wouldn't do that. But it's just stupid, because... <sighs> they just keep lowering my hours more and more, so I just basically tell them, give me more or I'm leaving. Because I do love the employees there. The employees I work with are freaking awesome people. Hello. Nope. Not gonna do it. I'm on a mission right now. And I will not be deterred. I wanna do some Daedra nonsense and get murdered. Murdered. And then immediately after leaving a note, which uh was a little it was a little nerve wracking, I'm not gonna lie. Basically could screw myself with it, but honestly, I don't care at this point. Hold on, before I go in there. I want to see what's over here. It looks like a guardian stone. Um, I bought a lottery ticket immediately after because I felt risky. <laughs> I didn't win. Mm. But I did get a, I get, I got a solid state hard drive for Christmas, which means I'll be able to record at a much... Oh, crap, fish. Um, get out of the water. I'll be able to record at a much better frame rate. Because it's, it's not that I... I have, a, I have a very good computer. I put it together with all the best stuff. But only one hard drive, which means it's very hard to run Fraps, the recording program, and another thing at the same time. It's pretty bad. Regeneration. I like my lack of damage more. But we'll see if... if I want to change that later. Probably not. I'll probably forget. Fishies? What you doing, fishies? Huh? What you doing? I'll yell at you. Oh, hey, I hit it. Nah. Okay. Um, should I just try and make it back across? I suppose. I'm going to get eaten. Save. I don't want to die. Uh, uh, fishies, stay away. I do not want to be eaten. I do not want it! No, I can't breathe. <sighs> That's murky ass water. Looks so clear from up top. Oh shit. <laughs> I would not swim in piranha filled waters. Or slaughterfish water. Slaughterfish sounds even worse. Slaughterfish just sounds messed up. I don't understand why they put slaughterfish in this game. I mean. It's kind of cool, you know, have an enemy in the water, but you literally can't fight back underwater, so I don't really... It seems kind of unfair. And I know that you can uh, sort of, like, cheat using them. Like, uh, if you sit on the edge of the water w while you're crouched, you can, like, get your sneak up to, like, level 100 really easily or something. What the hell? <gasps> that dog! <laughs> Get out of my life. Oop. That scared me. My crabs are ugly. Alright. This is scary. It's Daedra territory. I don't know how to handle this. 
Although I did learn that vampires aren't as scary as- Oh my god! While I was playing Gorgo, I learned that vampires aren't as scary as I thought they were, but they're still kind of scary. What the hell, dude? Hello. What you got in there? Dance and fire. A jur- I want to read the journal. I want to know what happened to this poor soul. He just seems like he- Was he just a fisherman? A decent catch of fish is getting harder to come by. Da ba da ba da ba da. Um. Um, people just said that lake was cursed and stuff like that. I'm not going to read the whole thing for you. Sorry. If you want me to narrate the entire books, let me know in the comments. But otherwise, I'm just not going to do it. I don't want to be obnoxious. Hmm. This place is cool, actually. It's all leaky. I'm leaky. Feel so cold and alone without my trusted companion, Mark. Marky Mark. Marky Markerson. Oh. Bring it, son. Never <laughs> hey, your skeleton died, Necromancer. Get owned! Son? What? Oh, jeez. No, there's more. There's more. Let's go. Boom. Stop it! Stop it! Stop it! That's what you get! You don't do that, man! Broski? You resurrected your friend to try and kill me, and he died twice. You made your friend die twice. That's pretty messed up. All things considered. Mixed unit tactics. Nothing. Uh, there's probably nothing there. Gotta be thorough. Uh, not so thorough that it's boring. Human heart, good. You guys are obviously sickos, good. Ah, I did not miss this. Ugh. Um, uh, I don't need a second emula of Mara, but I would like to keep it for the uh, the thingamajiggy with the enchanted maboodle and the stuff. But yeah, you know what I'm talking about. <laughs> I made perfect sense when I said those words. Of course I did. I always make sense. Uh, uh, I'm rusty. I'm rusty at this game. That's weird. Done. Easy. I dropped a worthless book of worthlessness. You guys are messed up. All this weird, ugly crap you've got around here is pretty messed up. Got human hearts and knives, and I'm sure there's a goat testicle somewhere around here. Oh, hey! <laughs> that was fun. And I'm. Why did I even pick those up? I knew that was gonna happen. Uh, more mysterious notes. Yeah, yeah. I already read that. I just want to get rid of... I like the journals, so I'm going to hold on to those. But these regular books can bite me. I know that. I know that. I should hold on to that. Boop. Boop. I don't need those. I already know them. And I'll never get around to selling them. So, yeah. How was your guys' Christmas? Tell me about it. I am genuinely interested. Tell me what you guys got. What was your favorite thing? My favorite thing was actually not the uh, the hard drive. Although it is really cool. My uh, my dad got me a 12 string guitar. So I am just rocking that thing. Playing some Hotel California. What are you doing? Is that all you've got? You're like just standing in a corner getting murdered. Ahaha. Hey you! Oh! 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 Hey! Stay back! Stay back! 
You too. Oh, in the face. Oh, in the shoulder thing. The arm part. Boop. Uh, sure. I really do need health potions. I use them all the time. I can't. I can't just leave it. Dink. Wee. Can I heal? Yeah. I feel like I got into more than I bargained for here. I thought this was going to be a, a short little, like, inside of that broken castle, but clearly it goes pretty far. And there's a lot of these guys. What the heck are you doing, game? Owned. You're next. Ooh, sorry. Right in the face parts. Oh, oh yeah! A bandit? Telling me to hold on, hold on, bandito. Uh, I want more magic. I like me some magic. And I already did restoration one point, so clearly I want to do stuff here. I don't want to do dual casting because I never pull it out on both hands. Healing spells cure 50% more? Oh. oh, where am I going? I don't know, this is a tough decision for me, so why is my speech buffed? I don't know. Archery? One-handed weapons? I don't really sprint towards enemies very much. Blocking! Arrows! That's what I wanted to do. Now I can just be like a boss and get into a phalanx with some... I need a, com I need a companion that isn't overpowered. Like Lydia! I'll go get Lydia! That'll be fun. Me and Lydia can go on an adventure and she can stand in doorways and not let me through. Another thing. Oh wait, never mind. I talked about that in the last video. I'm not gonna repeat myself. Not talking about the freaking Must Kill. I was gonna talk about the the, the uh the thing again. You know what I'm talking about. I don't know what I'm talking about. The soundtrack I got. That's it. I was gonna talk about that again. But then I remembered and I didn't want to do it again. So don't need one of these. And I don't need that. That'll work. I would use the alchemy table, but there's somebody trying to kill me, apparently. And I don't appreciate it, little guy. Stop it! Oh, fail. Uh, nope. I just smack. Why are skeletons just so fail in this game? Just kind of crumple. Whoop. Whoop. Ooh, whoa. That's some pretty powerful stuff. Can you teach me that? Ascendant Necromancer. I should save because. Jeez. That is so cool. Teach me your ways, bro. I don't want to fight you. I need to get close to this guy, because otherwise he's just going to keep doing that and murder me. He's going to unlock a door underwater. I feel like there's a college class for this. It's probably basket weaving. Underwater basket weaving and lock picking. Oh, man. Oh, man. Ow. Hey. Did I get hit? What the balls? Give me up! Give me up! I'm stuck in the water! Dang it! Dang it! Dang it! Dang it! Um, is there a way out? Or out? I'm gonna drown and die and it's gonna be sad. Running, running, running! Oh, look, I'm using two hands to freaking. Yeah, I said I didn't do that and then I did it. My goodness! That's really cool! But it's totally unfair right now. 
I can't even get over to you. Oh, get over it being cold, man. Okay, just stand there. I like it. Am I draining his magic with the lightning so he can't actually use his moves? That's pretty awesome. I think that's what's going on right now. Mm -hmm. This is nice. This is peaceful. It's like target practice, but with a person. That's wrong. That's messed up. Azura ain't gonna help you now, buddy. Smack. <laughs> Thanks for helping me get my archery up, bro. Oh, you're almost dead. Oh, in the back. I am heartless. But he's an idiot for standing there and just eating arrows like they were candy. Oh my god. I need to drop something heavy. Do I have anything heavy that I can just offload and never pick up again? Nope, because I like that. I want to keep it. It's like a collector's item. I'm dropping you. I don't care. Okay, I don't care. I don't care. Just get rid of it. Get it out of my sight. Okay, over here. Here's the steps. Oh man. You don't have any, like... Oh, jeez. Oh, I thought that went in his mouth. It's still pretty bad. I'm sorry, dude. I'm upset right now that he doesn't have a uh, the spell book on him, because I wanted to learn that. That shit was cool. And that is a loud candle. What you got here? More crap. <gasps> <sighs> Screw you, game. Making me pick up cool stuff. It's obviously your fault. You're making it happen. It's forced upon me. I don't want to. I don't want to. Ah, drop them all. Cabbage everywhere. Wait. Oh, that's no fun. I wanted to drop it everywhere, game. Okay. Boop. Dwarven Bow of Animus. Now, are they the same stats? Yeah. But one of them will fill soul gems for me. My god. Let's use this for a bit fill some gems. It's super purple. Nope. Er, nope. None of those. All those are wrong. Seriously. I've gotten worse at this. Ah, ah never mind. I'm amazing. I'm just the best gamer of all time. Juniper berries. More potions I shouldn't carry. Whee! Bar. Wooden door. Hmm. Interesting. All right. Well, before I ch travel through this into Elinalta's deluge, I will pause this video. So. In the next episode, we will be going into Inalita's Deluge, or Deluge, or Deluge, I don't even know, and uh, doing whatever the hell's going on in there. So thanks for watching, guys. Like, comment, subscribe. It's good to be back from Christmas, and I'm done with you people.